friend of mine sent me a link to, I believe, maybe the Decibel article, and I was reading about this yoga class that wasn't the traditional style and uh, was accompanied by music that I found meshed really well with the contemplative practice, and I thought, this is already kind of what's in my head. I want to kind of like make it as natural, organic as possible and kind of recreate sort of the way that we've done jams and things like that in the past because that's, that's what we're really trying to capture this weekend. I just remember she shut down all the lights. It was the music for me. Honestly, it was just the music and I was just like, this is awesome. It was, it was definitely, for me, it was more real. Uh, you know, like I said before, you want to learn to feel, just be okay with everything, good or bad. And, you know, Kimmy says, you know, if negative stuff comes up, you know, now's the time, let it come up. There's a little more intimacy with the black yoga, and it's not just because the lights are dimmed. There's more introspection, less judgment, I suppose. Yeah. We all have those uh, deep, dark points in our lives, and we also have light spaces in our lives. And I think it's a nice, um, it's a nice practice to sort of look to balance those. So after doing black yoga classes for a couple of years um, with our mixtapes, we decided to do our own music. So that's how the Black Yoga Meditation Ensemble was created. We then signed a deal with Screaming Crow Records and we are putting out a DVD. It's an hour long class which will be out this fall and there will also be a CD available of all of the music done by the Black Yoga Meditation Ensemble.